Shabbat Shalom to everyone. From the rising of the sun to the going down of the same, Ahaya Asha Ahaya. O Holy One of Israel, Lord Most High shall and will be praised. All knees is going to bow and all tongues is going to confess the almighty Elohim, the creator of heaven, earth, the sea, and all that therein is, the almighty Elohim of granddaddy Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and the 12 tribe of Israel, which I am of the royal house of Yahudah. I am a Yahudi. Praise Ahaya Asha Ahaya. May he reign forever. So in this video, I wanted to talk about numerology. I'm having my orange juice. Get my vitamin C. And potassium. So I wanted to talk about numerology. The book of numbers is the study of numerology. There's 12 tribes of Israel. There's 12 months in a year. Um, the most high told us, Zion, when we was in our ancestors' loins, when they were in Egypt and in the wilderness, I believe it was, and he told them to march around the wall of Jericho. How many times? Seven. And on the seventh time, do what? Shout. And the Sabbath is on the what day? Seventh day. Yeah, we are numerology. Mm -hmm. Shabbat Shalom. Today is the seventh day. Six days he worked and the seventh day he did what? Rest. So I say that to say this, that today is the Shabbat and it's the seventh day and numerology is a science, cosmos. The only thing in the cosmos is power. I came across where well, all of the Psalms are powerful, but this particular one stuck out. Um, I think it was Psalms 126. In one of the verses, it says, they that sow in tears shall reap in joy. This particular Psalm talks about the almighty um, delivering us, bringing us out of captivity. And one of the verses says, they that sow in tears shall reap in joy. So to all 12 tribe of Israel, we shall reap in joy. And also the most high, in the Old Testament, he told us to write it down and make it plain. That's scripting. Because what you write is what's going to manifest. What you speak is going to manifest. What you think is going to manifest. We are magical. So I am going to do my numerology on this powerful day because this is the seventh day. That's numerology right there.
The Shabbat is a very powerful day. Take advantage of it and work your magic. Holy and set apart. So this is my, one of my books. I do my scripting, all this magic. So I would say to those of us that's practicing our spirituality, today is a very powerful day to do it, okay? So I'm doing it now. Don't don't tell what you you're writing down because it's for you. It's not for someone else. But just the knowledge to do your scripting okay. and the power importance and spirituality in numerology. I had, I had to bring that out because for some reason, Zion, they get themselves, they, they, they speak against themselves and don't even know it. We, we, we lost ourselves and everything that the enemy told us that was evil, it is not evil. But what is really evil was us not worshiping the most high. That's why they kept the Old Testament away from us and shoved those lies in that New Testament. But praise the Most High. He delivered me and I delivered me because I never cared for religion. It never worked for me. I'm glad it didn't. So Shabbat Shalom. Practice your, 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 your numerology, uh, Zion. We're magical and powerful. Shabbat Shalom. <laughs>